In this video, we're going to solve the system of equations using Kramer's rule. So the solution using Kramer's rule looks like this. X is going to be to equal to big D sub X over D, and Y is going to be equal to big D sub Y over D. So the first step in using Kramer's rule is you compute big D. So big D is the determinant of the coefficients. So 2, negative 3, 1, 4. 2, negative 3, 1, 4. So to compute this, you do 2 times 4, which is 8, minus negative 3 times 1, which is negative 3. So this is really 8 plus 3, which is equal to 11. Now we have to compute big D sub x. So big D sub x. Oh, if this had been 0, then there's a problem here, right? So it turns out that when big D sub big D is 0, that you have either no solution or infinitely many solutions. But in this case, big D is not 0, so we do have a unique solution. Now the trick to memorize big D sub x is you just look at the x's here and you replace them with the 1 and the 2. And then you keep the y's, so negative 3, 4. So this is 1 times 4, which is 4 minus negative 3 times 2, which is negative 6. 4 plus 6 is 10. Finally, we'll compute big D sub y. So in this case, you keep the x's, so 2 and 1, and you replace the y's. So you replace these guys with 1 and 2. So in this case, we get 2 times 2, which is 4, minus 1 times 1, which is 1. So 4 minus 1 is 3. So the final answer is x equals, well, let's see, big D sub x was 10, and big D was 11. So 10 over 11, that's the x coordinate. And y is equal to big D sub y, which was 3, divided by big D, which is 11. So that's the y coordinate. If you wanted to write the answer in ordered pair form, it would be 10 over 11, comma 3 over 11. And that's it.